Hey what's up guys my name is Krishna here from Get Googles. In this video I am going to give a quick review on Android Lollipop. If you want to install it manually I have provided the link in the description you can follow that. First I would like to talk about the lock screen. You can access the notifications directly from lock screen. Also can be dismissed by swiping left or right. Compared to previous TouchWiz, there is a betterment in the speed of launcher. We have an option to set the transition for the home screen itself. You can set 3D rotation or card stack or you can set it as none. App drawer is smooth and fast. Coming into the notifications, now it has been turned into transparent. When I first installed the software, I found that mute option was missed, but it is given back again with a minor software update. Coming into the other features, also I have found that smart scrolling and tilt was missing. Though some people really don't use it, but some people just love it. They also made some changes in the apps like file manager, dialer, calculator, gallery, clock, etc. There is no changes in the camera, but except with the improvement in the speed. Now, task manager has been improved and I like it a lot. It is more consistent to use. Going into the settings, everything is changed with little animations and you can see the lollipop toggles or buttons whatever you call. I even found a missing feature in the lock screen that is face and voice unlock which was missing. And, and the rest of them are okay. Do comment if you find any other bugs or missing features. Guys to say frank the battery life is too too bad it gives approximately 3 hours on normal usage and less than 2 hours with the high usage. Finally this was my quick review on Android Lollipop. If you like this video please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching my video. I see you in my next video.